A truly disturbing, disgusting controversy has erupted at a neat exam centre in Kerala's Kollam district today, sparking anger and outrage among the parents of students who were taking that exam. This controversy in Kerala's Kollam district has sent shockwaves and you will see why. A girl student was among several who was asked to remove her inner wear before entering the exam hall to sit for the NEET exam. The student's parents have filed a complaint at a police station regarding this matter. In the complaint, the parents allege that the student was asked to remove her inner wear after a metal detector at the exam center detected metal components in her inner wear. The complaint says that 90% of women students at the center were asked to remove their inner wear and keep it safe in a storeroom. The complaint also mentions that these students were tortured mentally and that the dress code by the local authorities does not suggest in any manner the removal of inner wear to sit for the exam. I am one of the victims. My knee exam was at the bottom of the Institute of Information Technology. I do face a difficulty at the time of checking in the inspection area. The metal detected deep, so I was asked to remove my inner garments. But but it was plastic and they do also confirm it was plastic. But even though they asked me to remove, not only me, majority of the girl candidates were being asked to remove. We all did remove it was losing our self-respect and we went to the examination without it. It was very shameful and uncomfort for us facing the volunteers all too alone and also to sit with the main candidates in their class. It was very stressful that we couldn't concentrate our exam we prepared for our future. After this exam, our inner garments were damp together in a dark room, so it was very difficult to identify ours. The female volunteers were also very harsh. The great opportunity is being missed for us in the exam. It is very painful for us and our families. Kathy would have a Pradamiga inspection Kajan Hashamana Parano, Avalda, Inner World and the Huku, Metal Dictator and the Arches Sound Egono, Adunda San, Woody Martin, and Narod Avisha Petta Pragaram, Avalka, other Sadikila and the Parana Epan, good to reward Mendeli Halash, Shedu, Adin Hasham, Udioga San Valilla Karangi Vergayam, Namala Vilchiva to Gayam, Namala Gayan the Shal, Wangi Kundu Pogayam, a good examination. Kayar gaya ini jadi examination halil perwesi tu perih sejadi. Pasalnya, awalnya nara na sambo yang dah nuh cie nyal. Ii kute yang nalla. Awalnya panggad itu ayat esam tu nol cina mana pen kute gelda yum. Inner way is matta wuji. Awal wari us choro mele keep cie dite. And joining us live uh, from Kerala this evening is R. Bindu. She's the Minister of Higher Education in Kerala. Uh, uh, Minister Bindu, thank you for speaking to India today. I am sure it has come to your attention, Madam, this, uh, uh, this very disturbing story from Kollam District where students taking the NEET exam were asked to remove their inner wear before being permitted into the exam hall. Uh, can you tell us what action is being taken in this regard, Minister Bindu? Yeah, a, a NEET exam is being conducted by NTA uh, and it's from central government. The action should be initiated from the central government itself. The employees are being employed by NTA. So we are planning to write to NTA and central government regarding this. Uh, such I... incidents should be repeated in future because it will uh, create far-reaching consequences on the psychology of uh, students writing the exam. They will Are be you... highly disturbed. Yes. Have you had a chance to speak with any of the students, the madam? Exam. The girl was not able to attend the exam in a satisfactory manner due to her mental turbulence. Hmm. So this, this was a very heinous, deplorable act from the lady employed by NTA. Are you conducting any investigation at your end, madam? Yeah, we have already conducted investigations and we are planning to uh, intimate our uh, arrest and protest against the so central government and the NTA. Because, because, madam, this is not the first time this has happened. It's happened, uh, you know, uh, uh, back in 2017. I was just yeah, looking at some the, news reports. The, uh, it's happened the, before the also. 
actually the instructions are given by nta national testing agency mm. they are responsible for this so we are planning to intimate our uh, uh, protest against this can you tell us how you can plan you to take me? this up yes i can hear you madam i can hear you please go on uh, uh, we are planning to write to the central government and to nta to avoid such incidents in future because this drastically affects the psychology the, the mental landscape of our children they are highly yes. uh, disturbed upset due to such activity ma'am if this has happened earlier in 2017 also and has been happening and is happening again now then then where is the lapse ma'am why was the why were the rules not changed or you know some sensitization happening on the ground how can something like this happen for the second time such rules and instructions are given by the central government uh, i am repeating yes i understand ma'am but done by our higher education department but it is uh, the decision taken by nta national testing agency minister so i understand that we are that. planning to intimate them about the I understand ma'am but Kerala is not the only place where the neat exam is taking place it has not been heard of in any other place where neat exam happens which is why I am respectfully asking you ma'am is there some particular issue uh, it happened in Kannur in 2017 now it's happening in Kollam here is there is is there some specific issue that it is happening in Kerala I am not aware of it happening anywhere else ma'am So uh, I told you many times we are planning to write to central government to avoid such instructions hmm. instructions regarding dress code and all I I are you suggesting some change in dress code or something like that ma'am There are certain things which can be interpreted in a very different manner hmm. such yep. instructions should be avoided How do you plan to sensitize the uh, you know from your end as the minister in Kerala I I understand I take your point ma'am but th this is uh, NTA uh, it is a central I government a press meet. Yes just yes ma'am I conducted a press meet and I expressed our protest against such activities and will take uh, precautions What would be your message to the girls themselves and their parents ma'am because they would be looking for some kind of reassurance from you i am sure they would be very reassured by you taking it up with the central government would you have any other message last comment any other message for them of reassuring them ma'am i have conveyed i have conveyed my message not only to the girls but also to the general public of kerala and we are planning to extend our uh, intimation to central government and nta today itself we will do it we will send uh, emails to the concerned authorities to avoid such instructions okay okay our bindu minister of yes. higher education of kerala thank you very much for speaking to us uh, 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 she she says that she is going to be taking this issue up with the central government didn't answer the question over why uh, you know this kind of very strange rule uh, you know has been applied uh, a couple of times in kerala since 2017 uh, at least as far as i am concerned i don't believe it has happened anywhere else so is there a sensitization issue is there some a wrong interpretation of the dress code rules uh, in exam calls in kerala we'll get to the bottom of it it's an unsettling scarring story the minister is absolutely right it can damage the psychology of students imagine asking them to remove their inner wear and then go and sit and take the exam unbelievable story this has happened today from kollam in kerala we'll keep a track and get you the latest on it